So this is the look I came up with. It's a very greeny color with a gold lip and I did a winged out eyeliner look. Um, yeah, so this is the look I came up with for St. Patty's Day, which is on Wednesday. So yeah, if you want to learn how to get this look, just keep on watching. And I also forgot to say that there will be pictures at the end. Are you sniffing the camera? Okay, so I've already done this side, and now I'm going to move on to this side. And I've already applied Urban Decay Primer Potion on both eyes, so yeah. Whatever um, eye primer you have is just, you know, it keeps your uh, eyeshadows from creasing and it will last a lot longer. First, I'm going to apply Mildew, which is a greeny, it's like a, kind of like a forest green kind of color, and you just want to apply this all over this part of your lid right here and I'm just gonna take like a, a an eyeshadow brush just like this just wanna pat it down It doesn't have to be like super neat or anything because you will be blending it out. Okay, just like that. And you're going to go with an outer corner color and then I'm going to go in with oil slick which is just like a black um, sparkly color my dog sleeping in my laundry basket right next to my desk it's really cute you can draw it on however you like how it have so far. It looks kind of crappy right now, but don't worry, it'll look a lot better. Okay, then I'm going to go in with like a blendy brush and just feather it out. Then you can go in windshield wiper motion to blend it out as well. Okay, so then after you've blended it out, you're going to go in with a really light green color. I'm going to go in with this color right here, and this is from my Lang or, yeah, Lancome Mini Color Focus um, yeah, palette. I don't know. I got it a really long time ago, so I don't really know. don't remember. Okay, so then you're going to go in with a flat brush. This is the one I'm going to be using. You just want to go over that uh, mildew color that you put on just to brighten it up a little bit. Then you're going to go in with the blendy brush again and just blend that together with, with um, oil slick. Yeah. Then I'm going to go in with Naked by MAC. It's MAC Pigment. And I'm going to use this as my highlight color and then my inner corner highlight color. You hear that noise? It's my sister blow drying her hair.
and just pat down. Then get your inner corner. Okay, then I'm going to grab my blendy brush again and just blend that out. Mix in with that naked in with the oil slip too. And then I'm going to go put on my eyeliner, curl my eyelashes, and apply my mascara, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I applied my mascara and my eyeliner. And for my eyeliner, I used this Lux Eva um, liquid eyeliner. And then for my mascara, I used Lash Bla or I'm sorry, Lash Stiletto. And then. For my waterline, I used MAC PowerPoint engraved. I'm running really low, but I have a backup. And yeah, and so then I'm going to apply my bronzer. I've already applied my foundation, which I used the Neutrogena Skin Clearing. And so yeah, I'm just going to be applying the Physician's Formula the balls with the little balls in it. Um, bronzer and again I'm going to be going in with my Sonia Kashuk um, blush brush and do the dumb fish face it's not dumb right it off, go on with the other side, you just want to go right underneath your cheekbone, and I'm going to go on my forehead too, yeah. She just got a haircut, so she's super soft. Then I'm going to go in with Kabuki brush and um, blend that all up. So you don't have any harsh lines or anything. Okay. And then for my lips, I'm going to be applying Glaze Sensational by the Style Warrior Collection from MAC. And it is a goldy kind of color. You can see that. Yeah. And I've already applied my Burt's Bees to moisture up my lips. And on top of that, I'm going to be applying Lip Glass Gold Rebel. Looks like this. Very cute packaging. Okay. Just like that. Okay, so this is my final look. Okay guys, well thanks for watching, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and see you next time, bye!